Welcome guys to today's tutorial. I still remain your main man HOT Creations and this know it is sponsored by Dotsby Productions. This is a one-stop shop media house where we are giving you all what you need when it comes to video productions, events coverage, just name it when it comes to media. We are here for you. Today we will be talking about this old piece. 24 to 105 Canon zoom lens. This is the most versatile Canon lens ever produced. This is a lens that is very, very durable, strong, good focal lens. So we'll be talking about five reasons you can still use this lens in the year 2023. We have two types of this lens. One, one of Mach 1 and Mach 2. Mach 1 actually comes with a 5D Mark II that was when that camera came out some years back and you can only find the Mark II now as a kit lens of 5D Mark IV. When you buy a new 5D Mark IV, you are going to, to get this beautiful 24-105. to To the focal lens, this lens is a very, very, very powerful one. It is f4. What I mean by focal lens is very simple. When you zoom in and zoom out, it maintains the same amount of light. You don't need to tweak your light when you are zooming in or zooming out. Everything still remains the same. I bet you if you are a careful person, this lens can last you a lifetime. Yes, mark my words. Because when it comes to strength, um, this lens is a very rugged lens. Even when it's raining, you can use this lens to shoot. Don't be scared. <laughs> you don't have to be scared. I know you, you must have been wondering, what's this guy saying? Yes, I can tell you that. When it's raining, but not every rain, please. I'm not going to beg the bank for you. Bro. But at least there are some cases that rain will be dripping. You will want to capture that beautiful moment. This lens got you covered. Even when it drops, Try not to let it drop too much, but you are still going to be safe when it drops once in a while. Just make sure the face is not eating the floor. But when it comes to the body, it's still fine. As I just wish you can feel it, this is, I think this one is still somehow. And it gives you that, um, that assurance that you are using a strong object for your shoot and also i'm going to talk about it being a full frame or a crop sensor now if you are using a full frame camera this lens works well for you and if you are using a 4k camera this lens still sits well for you now you must be wondering how will this old lens work with the new generations of 4k cameras I also don't know, but it works fine whenever I put it on my crop sensor and my full frame cameras. So what else do you want? Full frame or crop sensor, just plug in and you start shooting. So again, we'll talk about the, the millimeters. This starts from 24 and ends in 105. So basically it covers almost everything, every range that you need when shooting from the wide to the close range of your object or that, that image you want to shoot. You know, in most cases, when you are on 38mm or, or 35mm, you will always get a good frame of your shot. So if you want to go extra wide, you can stay on the max of 24mm. But if you want a wider range, then that's when you, you're talking about the 14mm and the 16mm, which not in all cases, you will always need that. But for the ranges of these lenses from 24 to 105, I think you have everything that you need to get a good project done for your client, for your stubborn client, for your wilder client, and for that good client. For those that love shooting handheld, again, this lens is good for you because it comes with an image stabilization. You get an image stabilizer. You don't have to worry 
yourself too much when you're shooting and out if you're if you're gonna have a shaky shot but um when when it comes to image stabilization of a lens you also have to be careful when using your camera and held but it will give you that um, assurance that you won't have too much of a shaky shot you can't expect to have this lens because we have the image stabilization um, option and you are shaking your camera and you expect it to be stable no this is not a gimbal even gimbals you will have to work steady to get a smooth shot but when it comes to you being careful enough to handle your your camera without the help of a tripod this lens gives you a well steady shot There is one thing I really don't like about this lens, but I know it's something that I can still get off with. When it comes to the edges, as you are seeing now, at the edge of this shot, you will see some distortion there at the edge. So, but when you are at the middle of the shot, you, you will see that it is very sharp. And I observed that this actually happens when you are using a full frame camera. But when you switch this lens to a crop sensor camera, it is very very sharp all those distortion at the edges won't be there so i prefer using it on a 4k camera if i want to get a good job and a job that some clients won't want to behead me for it is somehow hard for you to see a new one of this lens because it is an old lens in most cases you are still going to come across the used one both yeah i mean yeah in Nigeria or anywhere across the world which you can ship it down to Nigeria. It's if you want to add it to your box, it is still affordable for you as a Nigerian. You know, you know, you can still get it for like two hundred thousand naira and two hundred, two fifty, two hundred forty, depends on, on your seller and you can also import it from anywhere across the world. But I think you it is very it's gonna be very hard for you to see the new one because it is an old piece of lens but for the Mark II you can still find the new one because I think that was released in the year 2019 or 20 or so so now you can still get the new one for the Mark II and I'll suggest if you want to get the Mark II just don't buy only the lens you can just buy the camera because it comes with the Mark II this 24 to 105 is a kit lens for Mark II and it's also a kit lens for Mark IV. You must be wondering why am I saying a kit lens is a very good lens. Yes, it is. Forget it's a kit lens. I bet you. It is something that you will always want to have in your purse when you are going for a mountain shoot, a pit shoot, a wedding shoot, a movie shoot, a tutorial shoot like this every kind of shoot you want to do at Dudley Productions you can rent it for as low as 7,000 naira yes 7,000 naira for a day you know we always give discounts the more the days the lower the price we are always available anytime any day or you can visit our website at www.dudleyproductions.com or download our app on a google play store or apple store for you to shop swiftly on in your bed anywhere you know you can be shooting and you don't know where to get an equipment from it's simple just log in into your app or visit our website we will always 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 come to your head so see you guys next time solomon god thank you